King Charles, during this period of public mourning for Queen Elizabeth, we are mindful that you and your family grieve on the passing of a mother. Not my king. Booed by Australian Senator the British monarchy committed genocide against my people, said Independent MP Lydia Thorpe. King Charles III was booed by Australian senators who accused the British monarch of genocide during his visit. As Charles finished his speech at Parliament House in the capital, Canberra, independent Aboriginal MP Lydia Thorpe of Victoria interrupted the event and took to the stage. They committed genocide against our people, Thorpe added. This is not your country, you are not my king, she said. Give us our land back. Give us back what you stole from us, our bones, our skulls, our babies, our people. Charles was booed for about a minute, after which the senator was led away by security. You are a genocide. Attendees, including the King and Australian Prime Minister Anthony Albanese, remained seated and did not comment on the incident. This was Prince Charles' first visit to Australia since ascending to the throne in 2022, and the first visit by a British monarch to Australia since 2011. Once a collection of British colonies, Australia became a federal state and gained independence in 1901, but remains a constitutional monarchy with Charles as head of state. Although in reality Charles' rule is purely symbolic and he plays no role in day-to-day -day Australian governance, opinion polls show divided support for an Australian republic. Buckingham Palace officials wrote on Prince Charles' behalf earlier this month saying it is for the Australian people to decide whether Australia should become a republic. Thorpe released a statement on Monday, arguing that Australia should abandon the monarchy and make a treaty with its indigenous people. The king has invaded this country, failed to seek treaties with indigenous people and committed genocide against its people, she said. King Charles is not the rightful ruler of these lands. Prince Charles' visit was not without controversy, but Australia narrowly rejected becoming a republic in 1999. Australian Senator Lydia Thorpe explains rant after King Charles' speech Australian Senator speaks out again after parliamentary confrontation An Indigenous Senator who confronted King Charles has spoken out to explain why he yelled at King Charles after his speech in Parliament. Senator Lydia Thorpe told the monarch you are not my king on Monday and called for a treaty between Australia's indigenous people and the government. Ms Thorpe, an indigenous woman from Victoria, has long advocated for a treaty to recognise self-governance between Aboriginal and non-Aboriginal Australians and to right historical wrongs. The independent politician now said that as the current king, Charles must take responsibility for thousands of massacre sites in Australia. Hours after appearing in Parliament, she told Sky News, our bones and skulls still belong to him, or his family. We want them back. We want our land back and we want your king to take the lead and come to the table and negotiate a treaty with us. During their trip to Australia, Charles and Camilla faced subtle protests from supporters of the indigenous resistance movement, who held up banners reading Decolonize at several events.